In this video, we will introduce the St Kitts and Nevis programme for obtaining a citizenship through investment. This is known as a Citizenship by Investment programme and often abbreviated as CBI. We will guide you through the main requirements, costs, steps and benefits of obtaining a second passport. At the end of this video, we will also answer the most frequently asked questions about this programme. The St Kitts and Nevis Citizenship Programme has been active since 1984, making it the oldest and one of the most respected programmes of its kind. To be able to apply for this programme, you should be at least 18 years of age, in good health and without a criminal record. Additionally, you are required to make a non-refundable donation to the Sustainable Growth Fund or make an investment in government-approved real estate projects. To qualify for the St Kitts and Nevis Citizenship by Investment Programme, there are two investment options to choose from. The first option is a minimum non-refundable contribution of US$150,000 to the Sustainable Growth Fund. The second option is a minimum investment of US$200,000 in government-approved real estate projects. The property can be resold after a required holding period of seven years. If the property value is over US$400,000, the minimum holding period is five years. In addition to the minimum investment, there are government processing fees and professional fees that apply to both options. To get the updated and detailed cost, you can book a free consultation with one of our expert consultants by applying on our website. The process of obtaining the St Kitts and Nevis citizenship by investment consists of five steps over a period of four to six months. Step one, we will do an initial background check to make sure you are qualified to apply to the programme. If you pass the qualification process, a down payment of our professional fees is required to start working on your application and move to the next step. Step two, our team will assist you with the collection of all documents required by the government. Step three, once the documents are collected, we will submit your application and at the same time, you are required to pay the government fees. If you decided to invest in real estate, a reservation of your chosen property must be made at this time. Step four, once the government has approved your application, you are invited to pay the non-refundable contribution or finalize your property purchase. Step five, your citizenship certificate and passport are issued by the government. At this time, the balance of our professional fees will be settled and your new citizenship documents will be delivered to you. As a citizen of St Kitts and Nevis, you are entitled to visa-free and visa-on-arrival travel to over 150 countries and territories, including Hong Kong, Singapore, Russia, the Schengen area and the United Kingdom. You will also be able to expand your career and business opportunities worldwide. St Kitts and Nevis imposes minimal taxation, with an exception of no taxation on wealth, gifts, inheritance, foreign income or capital gain. Additionally, the country allows multiple citizenships, so there is no need to renounce your current citizenship. Yes, you can include qualified members of your family in the application, or add them in after you have obtained your citizenship for an additional fee. A qualified family member can be a child not older than 18 years, a child up to 30 years old that is currently enrolled in an educational institution, a spouse and parents above the age of 55. No, the government does not require you to pass any interviews, language tests or have previous work experience to be able to apply for this programme. Savory and Partners will assess your eligibility before submitting your application. Anything that might cause issues in the process will be explained to you before any action is taken. Once your file is submitted, the government will conduct their own assessment. Please note that you do not have to pay the investment amount until your application is approved. The government does not accept direct applications. You can only apply through a government approved agent like Savory and Partners. Thank you for watching our video for this Citizenship by Investment programme. For more information, please book your free consultation on our website.